Hello and welcome to Solid Cat. Today we are going to make this part. This is the advanced level part. So we will start with this uh, base plate. This is the good uh, place to start with. This is four millimeter thick and uh, A and B. A is 66 and B is 56. So let's start. Uh, there is uh, chamfers here. We will see to it. So let's start. Open a new file, part, OK. I will go to top plane. Draw a center rectangle. I will tab. I will tab it. Let me check. 66 till 66. Tab 56. Okay. Now, okay. I will go for uh, 10 mm chamfer here and 10 mm chamfer here and 16 millimeter here and 16 millimeter is there. I will go for fillet 2 mm. I will select all. Okay. Let's extrude it. Okay. Let's extrude it up to four millimeter. Okay. On this face, I will draw a couple of circles here. One here and one there. If this circle is of 10 millimeter, I think. 10 millimeter. 7 mm. 7 mm at four places. 7 mm. And this and this both are equal. This is 27. And this is 12 from here and 8 from here 12 and 8 12 and 8 sorry this is 12 this is 8 this is 12 like so both are horizontal I will draw a center line, mirror all, mirror entities, I will cut extrude through all, okay. You see here, this is 20 millimeter here, total length from here to here, this is 20 millimeter, okay. From here, this line to this, this, this edge, this, this is 20 millimeter, from center, so this is this 10 millimeter okay so i will draw a plane to 10 millimeter from to center center of the plane center of the front plane i will take front plane and go to features geometry plane 10 mm is okay okay on this plane i will select i will select this plane like so I will take it down a little bit. It makes me feel problems. I will draw a line here. Like so. And like this. I will give it a dimension. Of. Dimension of. 32 millimeter. 32. I will drop a point here and give it a dimension of 37.5 and 39.5 from here not from here from here 
39.5 let me check this is 39.5 and 37.5 in the center of this circle here okay I will draw a couple of circles here this is 19 19 millimeter this is 8 millimeter I will draw a line from the quadrant of this to I will drop it and another line from here to here I will draw another circle like somewhere like here this is 10 millimeter and 13 from here and 16 point 16 point 5 from here like so I would draw a line from here to this I'm I'll make sure this is tangent okay now I will draw a line from the quadrant to there and trim the extra like so I will use trim and extend it a little and then trim it all this line this point and this line are collinear this point and this point are vertical uh, horizontal sorry I will draw another sketch here a circle here and circle here this is also 19 millimeter and this is 10 millimeter let me check the dimension this is 19 from here and 12 from here 19 and 12 19 from here and 12 from here sketch is fully defined I will give a 2 millimeter radius of 2 millimeter okay here here and here okay now sketch is fully defined I will draw a line to connect these this okay now I will extrude it extrude 4 millimeter I will select this this I will select this select this this and this 4 millimeter reverse direction okay I will wake this up again and extrude this up to 8 millimeter there is a fillet of 4 millimeter here 4 and 2 millimeter sorry 2 millimeter and 2 millimeter here okay two millimeter like so I will wake this up once again and extrude this and this by one millimeter okay I will give it a 0.5 fillet here of 0.5 millimeter here and here okay now this this side is fully defined and complete only of all is left is to mirror this I will check this and mirror entities face uh, features to mirror 
I will take this boss. And this all all these things. Okay. The part is complete. Let me check the dimensions. I will show you the dimensions. Tools. Evaluate measure mass measure from here to here. It must be 36. It is 36. Okay. This must be 12. This is 12. This is 20. Okay. And this is 22. 22 millimeter here. Okay. All the dimensions are accurate. I'll hide this plane. The part is complete. I forget to give uh, the uh, material. Material is plain carbon, not plain carbon steel. It's cast carbon steel. Apply. Close. This is the material. Now I will go for mass uh, evaluate, mass properties. Uh, this is 237.1 gram. This is accurate result. And uh, I will give it uh, uh, appearance reappearance i will give it uh, 255 255 and zero something like that like so I think it's good. So this is our part. I hope you like it and enjoy the video. Please subscribe and have a nice day.